we're in Venezuela in Caracas. This is a place whose murder rate outstrips even Baghdad. And that's part of the reason why today and nearly every other day of the week, thousands of people are marching for the fall of the government. On the 18th of February 2014, Leopoldo Lopez, a leader of the Venezuelan opposition movement Voluntad Popular, was arrested. Over the past month and a half, Lopez and a coalition of groups opposed to the current Chavista government and the president Nicolas Maduro had galvanized student anger over public crime rates and turned it into mass demonstration and social disobedience. So one of the main tactics of the student protesters in Venezuela has been to set up roadblocks like these ones over here. So why are you guys protesting in the streets today? Hey, tell me how bad the crime is in Caracas. I mean, last year there were like 20,000 people, and that's wrong. Some people think the poor people of uh, Caracas and Venezuela uh, support the government, and it's just the kind of bourgeoisie who are doing the protesting. What do you think of that? We're not fighting against each other. We're fighting for a country. I mean, for everyone. We're fighting for everyone. For everyone. We're here for everyone. We want to live in a, in a country that is safe. According to many reports, the barricades have been subject to attack by a group called the Colectivos, who, according to who you speak to, are either the defenders of the People's Revolution or a militant motorbike gang employed by the state. So behind me, a politician called Maria Karina has just shown up and uh, everyone's kind of gathered around her because she's the most popular congressman uh, of the opposition. Uh, and it's been like a celebrity has shown up. Everyone's kind of run together and is screaming her name. <laughs> Police have come out, they've blocked the march, so everyone's having to be diverted in between the flats. And there are a lot of people quite angry about that. Oh, it was really, really calm, and then all of a sudden it went nuts. Behind me are the Chavistas who are protesting against these guys. Everyone's getting really angry, motorbikes are whizzing through the crowd. The mood's suddenly gone a bit crazy. Many people are suspicious of the wave of protests, accusing it of being a right-wing grab for power, organized by the same people who attempted a coup over Hugo Chavez in 2002, and claiming that it is only backed by the middle-class minority. With Leopoldo Lopez in jail, his wife Lilian Tinturi is rising in prominence. Yesterday she led a march through Caracas, protesting against police reactions to the demonstrations which have left 13 dead. No queremos más violencia, que no queremos sangre, no queremos a un muerto más, no queremos más muertos, queremos paz. 